Welcome to the MPC Lounge. In this video, we're looking at the new 2.6 MPC software using our step and grid automation, which is being driven by our MPCX in controller mode. This allows us to input, edit, and view automation parameters such as virtual instruments and plugin effects directly from our MPC hardware. So let's go to our melodic sample and we're gonna open up our channel strip and we're gonna add a third party plugin effect which I'm gonna open up inside the MPC software. So we have our delay, and we're gonna actually automate the mix wet and dry from our grid editor. Now to do this is very straightforward. Let's go to our main window, and we're gonna go over to our grid editor, and where you see velocity, we double tap and we add new. We go down to our plugin, which is our delay, and now we select our mix, and we can use our pencil tool to draw in the automation. So this is using the MPC hardware, and this is then being written directly inside the MPC 2.6 software. So there's our mix wet and dry signal moving from our automation. So let's put our quantize on, and let's build our rhythm section around this melodic. Now let's go to our hi-hats and let's automate these. Let's add some tuning. So velocity, then we add new, pad four, parameters, tuning. Pencil icon, and now we're gonna draw in our tuning. Now let's go over to the MPC software and you can see all the automation. We can also use our touch screen to zoom in into our automation, allowing us to add smaller increments. So now we've added tuning, zoom back out, and we'll add new, go to pad four, and we'll add pan in. And again, take our pencil icon, and we can simply draw across the screen, adding our values. And there is the pan in inside our MPC software that we've just written from MPCX hardware. So let's drop our 